Mr. Crow. Mr. Crow, he's out there. And we have finally learned to tell the difference between a crow and a raven. See the flat edge on the back of the tail on the crow? See how his tail is kind of, see they're sort of like more or less like square or you know fan shaped with a straight or a slightly you know curving back edge. That's crow. The raven's tail is like a diamond shape. Comes more to a point at the end. And is yeah, you know, there's a there's a perfect example of the crow. Kind of the tail with the sort of like a there's another one just flew up there. Oh yeah, there he is. So they're kinda interesting. And the ravens are bigger. And the ravens have a big fluffy like an it's, it's like we call it an ascot. Look at that guy. I wonder if he's building a nest, collecting stuff there. So right under their like chin and their front is, is a big. A raven will have a great big, you know, you know, fluffy pile of feathers that sort of stick out. And as the one website said, and the raven has a for a beak like a bowie knife. Well the crows have a pretty big beak too. And they're pretty darn big. Look at them. He's got to be stripping something. He's stripping uh, stripping that branch of fibers there. That's pretty interesting. Must be doing something building a nest I'm guessing. Maybe I don't know how crows nest. There's two of them out there too, which would be like, you know, maybe Mama and a Papa. And there they both go flying off together. Couldn't see the other one, but they both flew off together. Just two, same time. I would say nest building time. That was pretty cool. And the chickadees kind of bailed out while those were crows were around. I'm not sure if they cropped because the crows. I know crows will 